गुड मॉर्निंग एंड असल टू द स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ लेवल सिक्स दिस इज मी मैं सोपिया फ्रॉम फैलकन हाउस रामा स्कूल कैंपस नाइन वी आर डूइंग द चैप्टर एडवर्टीजमेंट एंड वी हैव डन द वर्क बुक एक्सरसाइजेस वी आर डूइंग द टॉपिक प्रेजेंट एंड द पास्ट पार्टिसिपल दैट इज ऑन पेज नंबर टू थर्टी फाइव ऑफ योर टेक्स बुक the verbs are the action words now i have just explain you that present participle means verb plus ing whereas the past participle means a third form of the verb that is what called the the past participle in many copies that i have checked the students have written wrong and they have written the second form of the verb but it will not come in the column of the past participle the third form of the verb will come for example drive is the first form second form of the drive is drove driven now this driven is the the driven the driven is the past participle tense think thought thought is the past participle tense whereas swim swam swam is a third form of the verb drink drank drunk is a third form of the verb the answers of this exercise are he was so shocked after the accident that he couldn't speak you have to tell whether the sentence and the word is present or past first of all you have to identify the verb underline the verb that is shocked that is the past participle tense galloping galloping is the verb plus ing of the verb gallop and is scared you have you have your own choice that what verb you will choose i if you are using galloping it means present participle and if you are using scared it is past participle tense write it over here i don't want that burnt toast burnt burnt is the verb and that is a third form of the verb burn it is past participle don't be don't be frightened again it is the third form of the verb it means past participle tense caring caring present participle excited again past participle but if you are choosing preparing it is present participle tense if the children are bored verb past participle now here is the example of the the first column is the past participle and the second column is the present participle tense verb plus ing you have to read and identify and learn the correct tense after that you will draw this table in your copies write down the first form of the verb the second form and the past participle become became become begin began b e g n begun the past participle tense you have to write down the stem word then the past form the second tense and this is the third column you have to write it down in your exercise books make this table thank you to the students of level 6 If you are not sure about your answer please write it with the pencil in the next class i will tell you the right form of the verb the first the first form of the verb the second and the third form of the verb the third form it is also called called past participle tense thank you